What's going on everybody? My name is Chris the Chaos Gamer and welcome back to Pokemon Snakewood. In the last episode, we uh, we finished off most of Rustboro. There's still one more uh, still one more uh, demon that we need to uh, kill there, but we have a major maintenance major weakness to its jinx, so we can't do anything with that. However, we managed to get ourselves to Rust Earth Tunnel and um, we closed off a portal and uh, what was it we had two battles right in a row this is just using Anareth the entire time on my way back to heal on my way out when I did my outro we saw that uh, this guy mo is now moved so we can go inside that building and see what is going on there before we do before we do we got some housekeeping stuff to do Let's go over our team. We have Sapuku, our Nuzleaf, level 18, with the left holding leftovers with Bide, Harden, Growth, and Nature Power. We have Mystery Egg, our egg that got hatched from an egg, which you guys can still name by using the hashtag ChaosWood in the in the comment section down below or on Twitter so that I can find your nickname to see what we are naming this thing because the name raider is on until Slateport, so it's not a little so it's not for a while ways yet. Um and heart this guy is rocking Harden and Leech Life, and we got Poic, our ball toy, level 18, rocking Psybeam, Harden, Rapid Spin, and Rock Tomb. Whew. Alright. So let's talk to this guy now. Strange demonic creature of the snail. Like a snail, except it uses this man's corpse as a shell. This is going to be very, very slowly. Which, oh, I get it now. So let's go in here. What's in here? This man has had his brains delicately scooped out through the hole in his skull the size of a ten pence piece. You are beginning to suspect the zombies have an unusual sense of style when it comes to killing people. Loot this corpse? Yes. Gamblefish. What is a gamble fish? Exactly. A fish that doubles the money earned in battles. Okay. So it's the amulet coin. I wish there was a sort that I could do. And oh my god, my all my cables are hold on. My cables are all wound together. Alright, have this there we go. Alright. <laughs> cable management. Make sure you always have your cables managed. Alright. Um you know what? I meant no. I'm actually gonna give this to Poic. Um because we did do a lot of, because we have done a lot of battles, we do have a nice bit of money. But I do remember that we were really short on cash for a, for a nice while, so we're gonna do that. We can we can't we can't get ourselves in here. The only way to wait. We used to be able. We can't get in there at all, really. I can get in through here. But I can't get in this way. Oh, that's because there's a rock there. I need rock smash. Alright. We're continuing on to Van Vernon Turf. Because apparently that's where we need to go. Wismer. I'm also looking for a fighting type because we need uh, Max Ether. I would love to have either a fire type or a fighting type. I know we are. No, I can't go there either. I know we are relatively close to. Whoa. What? What happened here? The town is ruined. Oh. Flashback! What's with this flashback? They don't usually hurt as much. Pestilence. Ha! The boot is on the other foot now. I knew you couldn't stand against us. And now all that remains is to bid you adieu. 
Okay. Oh, I must have passed out and fallen down the cliff. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do we have to battle her again? You? What are you doing here? You've interrupted me. I'll bring you to my boss. Oh, jeez. You? I remember you. You're, you're, you're pestilence, but from where do I know you, and why can't I remember anything about you other than your name? You. What are you doing here? I thought you were dead. Destroyed along with that deadbeat town. But wait, you say you only remember my name? Yes, that's right. Who are you, Pestilence? Pestilence. At least I had some success. I may not have killed you, but the impact appears to have at least erased your memory. Needless to say, however, I, Pestilian, Pest Pestilence, the only female member of the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse, Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse cannot afford any loose ends. And battle. So you are a member, one of the member of the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse. Okay. Moldor is bide. See what happens. Take it! It's a feel good, you can take it, right? If you use acid again, we're dead. If you use acid again, we're dead. I know. That's dead. That's D-E-D -E -D dead. Okay. Okay. Sorry, Seppuku. Let's go, Poic. At least I know your part, uh, that you're poisoned, so this side beam should hurt quite a bit. There you go. Almost one shot. Oh. Psy beam the hell out of you. I can't wait till I get an experience share. Experience share would be fantastic. Poic gaining that experience. Will fish another poison type. <laughs> well, this water gun will hurt. This psy beam will hurt even more. Alright, I'm actually going to heal. Uh, let's do a light potion. Yeah. Don't use another water gun. Toxic. There you go. You fucked up. You messed up. Big time. And fight. Side beam. And you're done. Unless you crit. Which you didn't. <sighs> Quillfish is done. Let's get that experience. Let's get to level 19. So, oh, no, 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 no. Wait, mm, no. Let's not learn self-destruct. Moldor, another Moldor? Cool. Hurt by poison, that's fine. Psybeam. If all four Horsemen of the Apocalypse use Poison types, then this should then... Fighting these guys would be easy, should be easy, quote-unquote. Should be. Knock on wood. Do I have an antidote? I don't think I do. There we go. Pestilent. Pestilence. What? You've certainly increased in power. $8,000? Yay! That's a lot of money. No matter. We shall leave this base for now and build ourselves another one. Come, Alicia. Alicia. I'm so sorry, Chris. I didn't recognize you in that disguise. Please forgive me for attacking you those times, but times have changed. I work for the horsemen now and I can't show you any mercy. I won't fight you this time. But next time... I'll go all out against you. Wait! You dropped something. Why can I remember anything about them? Wait a minute, what's this? Picked up the red thing. I remember what this is. It's a... We are how many episodes in? And only now we're getting the Pokedex. Wait. This is my brother's? He had it. No, I... no wait, he had completed his. 
I see your mermaid had one, but she didn't finish, did she? So this is hers. What was Pastil and so when the maze Pokedex? I probably stand a good chance of finding out if I can team the search. But now I'll use this Pokedex myself. Hold the phone. Can I do... Where have I seen a row? Oh, right. Is it gonna... There's a secret egg. Number 43. Okay, so I can see these guys. Sableye, Sneasel. Moldor. Okay, so I can see the undead versions of these mons as well, which is nice. There's Anorith. Shopit. There's Pikachu that I saw back in Pelberg Wood, Pelberg Forest. And Face Leech. Number 202. Wait. Huh? Oh. Uh, do I have an antidote? No, I don't. Maybe a berry? Poisoning! Oh, that amulet coin. That's why I got $8,000. <laughs> I only just remembered that. Alright. Let's use these potions. Heal up Poic. I need to get some. I need Sapuku um, alive again. Alright. The zombie appears to have been completely dizzy by the heat of the lava. Its dry body is on the verge of catching on fire, so perhaps you better move away. I want to know... Oh, that's the other end of the tunnel that I need. Um, rock... Um, blah, 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 rock smash for. Oh no, I can do, go up here. Charizard appear to be enjoying the heat. Oh, this is an actual Charizard. You think about catching it, but it as it has a color around its neck, you decide it belongs to someone and leave it alone. Aww. Whoa. What? Isn't it isn't Endless Plains interesting? I came here to visit. Welcome to Endless Plains. Thank you for visiting and please stay within the force field. What is th this is caught? I'm Larry the Looter. I've looted so much stuff that I have plenty to share. Take a look at my wares and see if there's anything you want. Ooh. We can buy some great balls now. Uh, let's buy... Let's buy a, a couple of great balls. Um, how many... Oh, I don't have any super potions I have. Let's buy a few super potions. Let's buy five. Fluffy Tail and Secret Plus. Oh, Special Plus is for Special Attack. We could buy ourselves a bit, a bit of Repel. Um, you know, let's, bu let's buy a couple of Repel. Um, freeze. Let's buy three of these. Water Ball. I think I already have one. So let's buy that. Awakening, let's buy a couple. Uh, Paralyze heal, buy a couple. Let's sell some stuff too. Um, I'm never gonna use Defend Plus. I'm never going to use Special Plus. Um, I technically could buy or sell all the Light Potions I have, but I'm not. Um, I'm really happy that I got cut, though. Okay, so we, we can't go anywhere past uh, past these people. Okay. 
interesting. So if that's the case, where does the south end of Rust Earth go? I got cut. Am I gonna? Mm. I'm trying to. I'm trying to think where, where, where I need to go now. Cause rock smash there. Oh. Okay, here we go. Who is it? Hey, Chris, it's me. Listen, I have news for you. I managed to reprogram an old military satellite. Jesus, Professor Birch, you're smart. And I've got a working connection with Duford. Ooh. Because it's an island, it appears they're completely unaffected by the plague. What does this have to do with me? Your brother and May were seen in Duford a few weeks ago. You should go and investigate. How do I get there? There's a trick. Here's the tricky bit. You'll need an HM Surf in a balance badge to get there. I don't know where you can find the HM, but I know there are a couple survivors from Norman's gym. I think they have a badge or two lying around. Look for them near Rustboro and ask. Okay, so we got ourselves a goal to go to near Rustboro. Here's Rustboro. Um, I'm curious as to what where Route 115 is. Probably still can't go in there yet. Maybe south of Rustboro. I still can't go in here, can you? No. Now, actually, since I'm here, I can heal up Sapuku. Okay, Sapuku's all healed up. And. There's a severed head. Route 104. I need to find these guys. Technically, if I had cut, I could go in there. I said they were near Rustboro. In here? No. What? He said that they were near Rustboro. But. They wouldn't be inside the trainer skull, would they? No. Um. I hope they're not in Route 115, because that would mean me having to. That would mean me having to replace a move. Oh, okay. Uh. He said they were near, near Rustboro. Let's... Okay, you know what? Let's go to Peltberg Woods. See if they're there. Let's make our way to Peltberg. Oh, unless they mean that part of Rustboro. I hope that's not the case. Route 104. Okay, you... Okay, so you don't have anything new. Back up Pedalberg, I still can't get in. I'm guessing I need to... Replace. I I need cut. Either I need cut into for Petalberg Woods, or I need cut to get into Route One Fifteen. All right. Um. If I can get the mystery egg to no cut, that would.
would be ideal. Now that I think about it, that would probably be the better idea. Can... Can this egg no cut? I swear, if he does... No. Seppuku do need, do, does need to know a move. And he does have a few moves that I will never use. Unfortunately, I have to use Seppuku as my cut. I will never use Growth. So let's get rid of that. Alright. Seppuku knows cut. Let's go. Let's cut. Alright. Let's check Pelberg Woods first before we check out Route 115. There's an item, which I want. And another worm ball because Pelberg Woods. And let's run and let's see what this item is. It is a great ball. Okay, not bad. Not bad. What's down here? Another area that I've never been to, and there's an item. Always nice. Always nice to have an item. Always nice to have items. I love items. And this is an attack plus. An item I'll probably never use. There's probably an item down there. So let's check that spot out. The problem with Pikachu is I want to... No. Let's not get Pikachu. Blue Rock. Blue Rock? Huh? Mm. Mag... Magan Pies love it? Magan Pies? Okay. I'm back at here. So I guess it's Route 115 I gotta go to. Let's very quickly check Route 115, and then um, we'll end it off. Because now that I think about it, that I just got caught. Birch is telling me that they're near Rustboro, and Pelber Woods is now completely 100% done. And I don't see anywhere else to use cut except for here which I can now get this item. And this is an Accuracy Plus, another item that I can sell off. And once I get Surf, I need to go over there. Cut is no good to me over here. So let's go to Route 115. That seems to be the only other spot to go. So let's, let's check out Route 115. Alright, Route 115, what's here? Item, Super Potion, nice. Okay, there's a guy here, that's probably the guy I need to talk to. But before I talk to him, let's, because it might trigger a battle, I, I, wa I want to be sure. Another item, Meteor Falls. Uh, you're a person of maybe possible interest. I'm the only trainer left alive from Petalburg Gym. That makes me the gym leader, and I need to... Oh, no. You're the one that I needed to talk to. Okay. At least I know that you use normal type. So, okay. Oh, sword stance. Uh oh. Okay. Of course, the one person that I'm like, okay, you should be. The, you're probably the one that I need to, that I need to talk to. Ends up being not the one that I need to talk to. And now your attack is up four stages. Make that six. This is going to hurt. If I can get the confusion off on this side beam. No. This is gonna hurt. Leer. Of all the things that you can do. 
Sword Stance and Leer. He gets an attack off. I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, Tapuku, you're up. Maybe your defense is high enough that maybe you could take a hit? I don't know. This cut isn't gonna kill, but... Or maybe it does. Cool. <laughs> that experience, though. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Fake out. Oh, yeah. I love using fake out. Delcaddy? I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna switch, use fake out, and away we go. Well, you guys are getting a long episode today. Three times, of course. Alright, Tapuku, you're up. Fake out time. Alright, and let's cut. Oh god. Oh no, I'm infatuated. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna bide. Never mind. This is gonna be a long battle. See, this would this would be nice to buy too. It would have been nice. Can I wake up? Thank you. Much now immobilized. Nope, here's the bide. Except now I'm probably gonna die. I'm probably gonna die. Please don't hit all five times. Three three times. If you only hit... No. You know what? <gasps> oh, you just screwed yourself. Please don't be immobilized. I think I won. Yes! Get that experience, Apuku. <sighs> that was hard and why I needed it to be. Now I got the balance badge. Balance badge typically is the fifth badge you get. All the badges are all I have. Now go and prove I wasn't just we go beat some zombies. Okay. I'm not gonna talk to you. Mm, 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 mm. Let's go the other way. <laughs> what else is there? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna end things off here. I'm gonna search out the rest of this route in the next episode. Um, because we're almost at half an hour. So, yeah, we've been going on for a little bit too long. I apologize for the long episode, but a lot, actually, a lot happened. We fought one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse. We got our balance badge. And, yeah, so we actually did quite a bit, and we got cut. So, I'm going to leave things off here. And if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before, and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one. I've been Chris the Chaos Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.